And the U.S. government says nearly 3 million Jeeps produced by Chrysler are a deadly fire hazard. But tonight, the company is taking a rare step, refusing to recall those vehicles. Vanita Nayer shows us what happens next. Craig and Kristen Romanik consider themselves a Jeep family. Just a, a really great, reliable car all around. The Romanics have purchased six Jeeps since 1994, including the two that are sitting in their central New Jersey driveway. The safety record of the Jeep has always been pretty stellar, and we always take that into consideration with the kids. But the federal government is calling that safety into question. The National Highway Traffic Safety Administration asked Chrysler to recall 2.7 million Jeeps because of a possible design flaw. Chrysler said no. The recall would have affected Jeep Grand Cherokees, model years 1993 to 2004, and Jeep Liberties from 2002 to 2007. NHTSA says the gas tanks for those vehicles are susceptible to rupture in a rear end crash, and that could result in a gasoline spill and fire. NHTSA says there were 37 rear impact crashes and fires involving the two models, crashes that caused at least 51 deaths. But Chrysler says. Its cars are safe. In a statement, Chrysler said it stands behind the quality of its vehicles and that it is committed to continue working with NHTSA to provide information confirming the safety of these vehicles. The Romanics own one of the Jeeps on the requested recall list. They're hoping Chrysler returns their loyalty and does the right thing. Well, if there's a simple fix for the, the fuel tanks to provide safety for families, I would hope that they would contact us and make the recalls happen. The company has until June 18th to respond to NHTSA's request. Vanita Nair, CBS News, Monmouth Junction, New Jersey.